What's up, dude? Welcome back to Why Not Ride. It's another episode of Gear and Gadgets brought to you by Revzilla. And we're gonna answer the question, what is the best brand to buy for gloves? Well, at the top of the food chain, you're gonna have the two premier leaders. We got Alpine Stars and Dainese. I don't have any Dainese here with me today because I sold them, but we're gonna go over a variety of different gloves. We got Sedici, Reacts, MBT Clothing, and Alpine Stars. So let's go down the line here. Let's talk about the NBT glove. This is a super lightweight glove. This is gonna be a very casual style riding glove. It's not gonna provide that much support, but it's lightweight, it's summer, and they feel fantastic. Then we got the Reacts Superfly Mesh. These are gonna come in at a good price range. They're $79.99. Reacts is a good brand. These aren't the best gloves I've ever seen. They don't feel that good, but if you're a first time rider and you don't want to drop 200, 300 bucks on a glove, this is a great summer riding glove, especially for you sport bike riders. Now we got the SPX2 Alpine Stars. These are coming in at 119, 129, 130. This is a great uh, daily rider glove. It's going to have a mid cuff. It's going to come up a little bit and protect that wrist. Um, nothing crazy. And the one that I really want to talk about is the Sedici Corsa. Now this is soft. Uh, it feels like a soft rubber. The Sedici Corsa feels fantastic, but I don't know if it's going to hold up. If you see, if we come in here, I love Alpine Stars, but everyone's uh, big thing with Alpine Stars is they're they're like, oh my gosh, like the seams are going to come apart. And low key, they do. On all the Alpine Star stuff I've had, even my suit back here, the seams start to come apart. It's pretty much the MO of Alpine Stars. But that doesn't make me dislike the brand. We're going to see if I can get a new one. But comparing these two, these are both gauntlet style. These are both uh, available to ride at the track. You can ride both of these at the track. They're going to meet the specs to allow you to actually enter the grid. Um, side by side, the Sedici Corsa is more comfortable, um, but the Alpine Stars, I just like the look better. Now, this feels like a softer leather. That's probably why it's so comfortable. Will this hold up as well as the leather held up on this? I guess we're gonna find out. But in your buying guide, it's gonna go most expensive to least expensive at $129.99. This is a great beginner racing style glove if you wanna start buying that racing style uh, material and gear. The Sedici brand is really stepping it up. I don't know if it's at par uh, all the way around full spectrum as a Dainese or as an Alpine Stars, but a great beginner brand to start buying that racing style gear. Again, the Sedici Corsa are sick. The React Superfly Mesh are a good beginner glove, but for the daily riders, what I would suggest is that SPX2. I absolutely love these from Alpine Stars or a Dainese one as well. But again, Sedici really stepping it up and the Superfly Mesh, uh, they're okay, nothing crazy. But uh, that's your buying guide right now for, uh, for this fall. And, uh, and I hope you guys like it. Gear and Gadgets concluded.